Welcome back everyone to your Easter Sunday stimulus update for today, Sunday, April 4th. And in this update, we're specifically going to be covering why you might be receiving a little bit more stimulus money than originally expected. Yes, that's right. A little more cash could show up in your bank accounts in the very near future. We'll be discussing it all in today's video. So let's dive right in and get to the breaking news. But before we do, as always, you know the drill. Make sure that you do give this video a big thumbs up, smash the like button if you have been enjoying my content, enjoying the output that I put out for you guys every single solitary day with no exceptions and no excuses. And if you'd like to see more content for my channel, do consider becoming a subscriber today. Click that big red button as well as the notification bell as well. That will actually notify you when I do post a brand new video, a brand new update. I do them every single day, so you're not going to miss a beat. The news is constantly changing so after you do those few things for me let's get started so did you notice a little bit of extra stimulus cash in your bank account well the answer might be maybe or maybe not yet because the irs just made a breaking announcement that could mean that many americans could receive extra cash with this new round of stimulus the internal revenue service has said that its third batch of payments includes for the first time what they're calling quote plus up stimulus payments. According to the IRS, the plus up payments will continue as the IRS is still processing returns for 2020 and even 2019. So what does this exactly mean? Well, under some circumstances, individuals may be eligible for new or bigger economic impact payments based on their most recently processed tax returns. So let's go over a few hypothetical scenarios that would be conducive to you potentially receiving a plus up payment. And this certainly could include you. So I'm curious if any of you would qualify for these plus up payments. Let me know down below in the comments. So perhaps a couple's income dropped significantly after a spouse lost their job during the pandemic last year, and they ended up making far less money than they reported on their 2019 income tax return. Or perhaps a parent now qualifies for more money because the 2020 tax return includes a new child or dependent which would boost the household stimulus payout. Such ongoing supplemental or plus up payments would apply to people who had already received stimulus money earlier in March, but the initial payment was based on a 2019 tax return, not the 2020 return that had already been filed. A drastic reduction in income in 2020 could make or break whether someone qualifies for a full or partial stimulus payment in this third round of stimulus. This is because the income cutoff with the latest round of stimulus is much lower than the previous two stimulus checks. Now, the IRS did note that some people may not be eligible for the third stimulus payment even if they received a stimulus payment last year or a stimulus payment in early 2021 based on the higher income limits associated with the first two stimulus packages. Remember, under the latest round of stimulus under the American Rescue Plan, an individual's payout begins to get reduced as their income hits $75,000. And then they would not be receiving any stimulus check if their income is $80,000 annually for an individual. When it comes to married couples filing jointly, their stimulus payments begin to get reduced if their AGI hits $150,000 in annual income and then the cutoff is completely at $160,000 in combined income. Many Americans did not receive a stimulus payment from the first couple early batches of stimulus checks that the IRS had initially sent out when the American Rescue Plan was signed into law. This is because the IRS did not have enough information on file to issue a payment but now those people are seeing stimulus money after recently filing a tax return that provides more information and indicates now that they do qualify in fact for an economic impact payment. In a statement, the IRS said, quote, payments to this group and the plus up payments that we discussed will continue on a weekly basis going forward as the IRS continues processing tax returns from 2020 and 2019. So if you didn't receive your stimulus check yet, you could see it in these next few waves. And yes, that includes a plus up payment if you are eligible for that. Now, we had also covered the fact that the IRS finally had released a timeline for people receiving federal benefits. This includes people on SSI, SSDI, railroad benefits. They're going to start receiving their checks if you have not received your check already. The IRS also addressed these beneficiaries in a statement saying specifically, quote, these payments will go to Social Security Retirement, Survivor or Disability, SSDI, Supplemental Security Income, SSI, and Railroad Retirement Board, RRB, beneficiaries. Now, while the payments to federal beneficiaries will begin to be issued this weekend, the majority of these payments will be sent electronically and have an official payment date of April 7th. So I wouldn't expect it this weekend. You might see it pending on your bank account, but that cash would not actually be accessible and available to you until the date of April 7th, if that is your payment date. Now, as we did discuss in previous updates as well, it's unfortunate they couldn't be part of this group, 
Why? I have no idea. But people on Veterans Affairs benefits will have to wait longer for their stimulus checks. Currently, the IRS is estimating that economic impact payments could be issued by mid-April to VA beneficiaries who do not regularly file tax returns. So ideally, you will see that check before the end of this month if you are a part of Veterans Affairs. Many of you regular viewers who consistently comment on my videos that have said for weeks and weeks in the past that they're on SSI or they're on SSDI, they're on Social Security, and they have no information on their stimulus checks, well, I'm glad to hear that you guys are finally receiving your stimulus checks. Many of you have finally commented that, yes, Logan, I am now seeing my stimulus check. It is pending. I just received it today. I just received it yesterday, and I love hearing that. Let me know down below in the comments. Hopefully, a timeline will be made available to us for veterans. I know we have a lot of veterans that watch my channel. I thank you for your service, and of course, I appreciate your support. More updates and developments are to come. This is your one-stop shop for everything stimulus. I do hope you have a very happy holiday. Enjoy your Easter if you do celebrate, and have a great weekend all around. If you did enjoy this video, as always, give it a big thumbs up. Smash a like button. I would appreciate that. And if you haven't already, do be sure to subscribe to this channel. Click that big red button as well as the notification as well to be notified when I do post a brand new video every single day. And if you'd like to get some free stocks all on me, feel free to use my links down below in the description. When you sign up with Robinhood and or Weeble, you'll get some free stocks all on me just for supporting my channel. Some of these stocks be valued up to thousands of dollars in some cases. Let me know which stocks you do get. We just had someone sign up recently and they got some free stocks. I look forward to seeing you guys in the next one.